I know it looks like we're sitting around here doing nothing, but I promise you we got big plans tonight. In my... Hey, welcome to my channel. My name is Renee and this is Pollux and Maxie. And we are getting ready to share with you the shipping of all of your fan club gear. Hoodies, baseball tees, and t-shirts. Yay! They're ready and I'm headed to pick up our order. Last time we did a video showing you our shipping process, you all really got a hoot out of seeing what was going on behind the scenes. I'm going to do another little video for you. I've changed I have tweaked a couple little things from the last time that we did a fan club order. I think you're going to like the changes. So, I'm going to let these guys take a big duty right now because I'm headed out to pick up all of the orders. I'm going to come home with a, with a car full of stuff and then we're going to have to get to shipping. So, here we go, fan club. This is what it looks like behind the scenes, shipping out all of your fan club orders. The first thing I want you all to see is that I actually do everything local. I am not using a third party drop shipping company to produce your shirts. I believe, truly, truly believe in shop local and eat local. So all of your orders are produced by a screen printer in my hometown of Paducah. So I'm here right now and I'm going in to pick up all of your shirt orders. So here you go. I have a car load full of Pollux and Maxi merchandise. And y'all, like I said earlier, I truly, truly believe in shopping local, eating local whenever possible. And so all of our merchandise, every time we do anything, is produced locally in Paducah. I use a designer here at Action Sports. That's our screen printing company. They print everything hands-on, in-house. I pick it up, I take it to my house, and then you're going to get to see how I package and ship out the orders with the help of Pollux and Maxi. So, yes, everything is done locally in my hometown. Look there, they pink. Purples. Whoop, whoop. I see some charcoal. Oh my gosh, what is it, Pollux? <laughs> what is it, Mary? Huh? I, no, don't chew on the box. What are you doing, dude? No, <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> okay, okay. That, that is y'all's fan club stuff. What do you think? Why are you chewing on that box? What are you doing? Okay, Mary, what do you think? Lots and lots of things. No, not time to play pox. We gotta do shirts. Oh my goodness gracious. Pink. Mm hmm. You tell him pox. Do y'all see my help? This is my help. Randy's gone. And this is my help. <laughs> Are you my helper? You're not a very good helper. You're supervising, you said? Okay, well, 
Pollux is supervising. Right, Pollux. But just so you all can see, I fold every single one of these shirts myself. This is all they do. Well, I finally have everything folded. One of my viewers in my last video said that I should just sit down and fold everything first. Kind of like, you know, a mundane task. Kind of like you fold laundry while you watch TV. Well, I decided that was a really good idea. But I couldn't do it sitting down watching TV because I needed a table and I needed to be standing up. So I just came up here. I've got everything sorted and I just folded the shirts. So now when I print each of the packing slips, I can just take it and walk around from table to table and get exactly what I need and then take it to my wrapping table and I'm gonna pop them out just like a system. Anyway, okay, hey, y'all. <laughs> I was up so late last night getting everything just sorted and folded. Got up early this morning, I had a YouTube video to release. So while you all are busy watching, are my dogs famous? I am starting to ship shirts. Every time I release a video, as soon as I make it public for you to watch it, I always sit down with my cup of coffee and I watch it myself. I respond to people who are commenting as they watch the video. I sit at my computer for about the first 30 or 40 minutes after I release every video. And so I'm just kind of sitting here like this every morning in my jammies. Yes, I'm still in my jammies. I slept in my shirt last night in my favorite little polka dot pants. I normally have these pants on when I'm filming videos. You all just don't know it, but I love my polka dot pajama pants. Anyway, there's a lot to be done today. I have to be at work at one, so I'm gonna spend my entire morning shipping shirts. So just so you know, as soon as I create a shipping label for you, you will get an email from me. It'll contain a tracking number for your shirt. So I'm gonna see how many shirts I can get out today. Here we go. A couple things I am doing different this time. Of course, you know, in your package, you get a thank you card. I changed the color so they're purple and you get a handwritten note from me and Pollux and Maxie on the back. And here's the big thing. First time we did the shirt orders, everybody got Pollux and Maxie's favorite dog treat inside their order, and I gave you one of the little hearts. These are their favorite peanut butter treats. They're from Newman's Own Organic Dog Treats, and I just sent one of the little hearts. I got so many messages from you all that that one little heart didn't get it. Either you had a really big dog and it was just gone in one gobble, or you had two dogs and you had to cut it in half. And so this time, everybody's getting two treats. So when you get your order, I'm tucking the treats right inside of that top shirt. So I know some of you all didn't see it and it fell out in the floor and you sent me messages because you didn't think you got a dog treat. I promise it's in there. It's inside the shirt. So look closely. Look how organized I am, y'all. Look at this. Sorted by color, by size. Look at this. This is my little workstation right there. And then in Brecken's room, I <laughs> have... All the pinks, right, Pollux? 
The pinks were the number one selling shirt, and because they're hoodies, they take up a ton of room. But everything is all sorted, and now Pollux and I are going to start gathering orders. Are you helping me today? Perfect. Let's get going. Then I come downstairs and everything has got to be weighed. So I gotta weigh it, write down exactly what it weighs, which is when you get your packing slip. You see that right there? That is the weight of your order, which has to go in for shipping purposes. So I get everything weighed and then I create the shipping label. So after I get them packaged and labeled, they all just go in a big box. I'm gonna fill up as many boxes as I can and take them to my post office on my way to work today. Colix, you're not being a very good helper today. You're just being snoozy today. <laughs> Did I wake you up? Pardon me. Box number one to the post office. So when you take stuff to the post office, if you don't know this, because I'm printing a, a like printing a prepaid label at home, I can actually put it in any of the little drop boxes in town, but it makes me a little nervous. So I like to take the, the orders inside the post office, hand them to the lady behind the counter, and sometimes I will even stand there and watch them scan each of the orders in. If there are international orders, I certainly watch them scanned in, and I have two on top. So I'm all organized, and I'm heading in with my orders. Well, I gotta quit talking to y'all because I am back home and I have more shirts together. I still have a lot, a lot of orders. Today, I got out all of the baseball tees and all of the t-shirts and now I get to get started on the hoodies and shirts that had multiple, like different shirts in the order. So I got a lot to do and that is what I'm doing tonight. And in fact, that is what I'm doing for the rest of the week. So if you have not received your email from me with your tracking number, it's coming soon, I promise. Your shirts are on the way. See you later.